one says naughty but spice and i've seen the word cinnamon i love cinnamon so so much i feel like i could get high off of this smell i'm well chuffed with that i'm, I'm getting the tingles i'm waiting for the tingles it's Megan here welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new here I hope you all having a fantastic day so far today's video I'm so excited to film because this week I went out and I finally managed to get my hands on the soap and glory advent calendar for this year this advent calendar kept going in and out of stock on boots so I was really disappointed when it went out of stock but came back in and I finally saw one in my hometown boots and I was like I need to grab that while it is still there. I think it's back in stock now on the website. I did get this with um, some money off so I managed to get this for £28 whereas normally it is sold for £48 on the website which is still a good price because um, I think it says it retails for £70 and 50p like all of the products in total so you're saving like half the price but yeah I'm so excited this is my first ever beauty advent calendar I've never had a beauty advent calendar before um, and I love soap and glory so so much in fact you can't even see it from here but I do have a soap and glory little um, hand food squirty pump next to my um, bedroom drawers um, just because it's really handy because you're always laying in bed and you're like oh my hands are dry I'll moisturize <laughs> but yeah so I'm so excited to open this this is actually massive um, and yeah it's been sitting in my room for a week now and I've been so tempted to, um, to open it my mum's just brought me a coffee in and I haven't had a coffee in weeks but they've got a new coffee machine, so I think they're a bit obsessed with making coffee at the moment. Anyway, just before I get into the unboxing of this, I just wanted to say thank you so, so much to everyone that has been supporting my channel recently. I recently hit 1k subscribers on here, and I did announce my channel in my personal life as well, which was a massive weight lifted off my shoulders. And I got so much support from everybody, and it was just so, so nice. So thank you so much to everybody. And as a thank you, this video is going to be a Soap and Glory giveaway as well, just as a celebration and a thank you for all of your support on my journey to 1K. So yeah, if you want to enter the giveaway, then stick around for the end of this video because everything will be at the end and how to enter. So without further ado, let's just get on to unboxing this. So I don't really know how to sit, to be honest, because it's so massive. But I'm just going to undo, I've got a little sticker on the front here, so we'll just undo that. This is what it looks like. Ah, oh, I'm stuck. So yeah, I can't even open it, it's so friggin' big. That's what she said. <laughs> this is the advent calendar, it's so super long and it's so, so, so pretty. So you've got days 1 to 24 on here. So um, let's just go in and start with day one. So we've got day one and it's over here. So I'm just gonna open that one first. There we go. So in day one, we get the Clean On Me Soap and Glory. Oh, it's a shower gel. I don't think I've ever had this one before. I don't think I've ever had a shower gel. Oh, it smells good. It's like their signature scent. So if you've had any of their like body butters or anything, it's their signature scent. That is gorgeous. I'm so excited to try that one. So yeah, it's 75 mils, which I feel like is, is quite good. And um, yeah, I, even though I haven't tried a shower gel before, I love Soap and Glory, so I know I am already going to love this one. So, moving on to day two, which is... Where is day two? Oh! Day two is this massive one here. Let's open that one. Oh, we've got something full-sized! So, day two is this. It's a full-size product for day two. And it is the Heels Genius Amazing Foot Cream. Ooh, I've never tried a foot cream before either. I can smell it. Let's put it on here. Oh, I really like that one. 
I can't think what it smells like though. It's a little bit citrusy. Oh, it's got orange and lemon extracts in this one. So that would explain why it's a little bit citrusy. I actually love a foot cream because I do get dry skin on my feet. The same as everybody does. So top tip with this, what you want to do is when you're going to bed um, or in the morning, put your foot cream on and then put your socks on top. Um, just so then it doesn't go on like the carpet and things like that and it really keeps the moisture in then so it's not rubbing off on everything and um, if you do it when you go to bed you wake up and your feet are so super soft so definitely there's a little top tip for you so for day number three is just a tiny little window this time so let's have a little look what is in there this one is a I think it's a little bath bomb I'll just show you up here so it is pink and white Smells just like the normal soap and glory things as well, so hopefully that is good. If you know me, I love bath bombs. I love Lush, so I'm always buying bath bombs from there. Um, so if you want to see Lush Christmas haul, I actually did go out and buy a load of stuff from Lush. It's not uploaded yet, but make sure you do subscribe um, just so you, you get notified when I upload my Lush Christmas haul. But yeah. I'm excited to try this one because this is better. Um, last year I didn't actually get the Soap and Glory Advent Calendar and it's because I watched a lot of reviews on it and they put in loads of these like shower pod things which were kind of just pointless. So this is definitely a better replacement rather than like a little shower pod which is worth nothing. But this will definitely be good. I like that one. It's nice and cute. Or oh, day number four is a little rectangle window. I wonder what's in here. <gasps> Oh my god. I'm so excited. I can't even get it out. I'm that excited. This is Sexy Mother Pucker. Now, I've had one of these before. I had the clear one before. And let me tell you, these bad boys juice up your lips so good. They make your lips feel all tingly. So, um, they are. I just love these ones. So, let's try it. This one is in bare enough. I don't know what it's going to be like. I have got like purple lipstick on today so I don't know what it's going to be like but I'm so excited. Ooh, I'm just going to put it on top of here. I just want my lips to tingle to be honest. It tastes so good as well. Definitely recommend this even if you don't get the advent calendar. Go and buy a sexy mother pucker because these are God's gift of the lip world. I'm, I'm getting the tingles. I'm waiting for the tingles. And I feel like it just gives you that extra confidence. If, like, especially if you don't have massive lips as well. I feel like it just plumps them up like really nicely. And obviously this is full sized as well. So that is amazing. Um, I think I worked out like there's 24 doors. So I got this for £28. 28 divided by... 24 so each product costs is costing me one pound and 16p this is a full sized lip gloss this costs in boots normally nine pounds so absolute bargain i'm well chuffed with that day number five is some tweezers look how cute they are it's the little um like soap and glory lady that is so cool i love that and then you've got soap and glory on the back and that's quite good because they're, they're wide, you can grip them really nicely as well. Yeah, I'm excited to use them. I actually just plucked my eyebrows this morning though, so I'm kind of annoyed. Because I'm going to have to wait until they grow back before I can use these. But um, I might put it back in the advent calendar and like reopen it on the 5th of December. Day number 6. I'm so excited because this one says naughty but spice and I've seen the word cinnamon. I love cinnamon so, so much. This is limited edition as well. I haven't even said what it said yet. But this is a little body wash. This is also um, 75 millilitres as well. The same as the um, other body wash shower gel that they put in there. But this says cin cinnamon and it's limited edition. Oh my god. That is amazing. Oh, I friggin love that. Oh, it's got a little bubble in. Oh. I'm more excited to use this one than the other one. Just, I love cinnamon and all of like the autumny winter smells. That is my favourite one so far. Ooh, day number seven is something that I've never tried before from them. This is the face and face soap and clarity vitamin C facial. 
can't even talk today facial wash this is um what size is this this is 50 milliliters so it's good three in one daily detox smooth cleanses and purifies oh it smells really good it smells um kind of like a little bit minty in a way so i feel like when you use it on your face it'll be very refreshing i think my friend zoe uses this as well because she does use the face and glory um face wash and she recommends that she's always going on about that but um yeah i'm excited to try this one as well if a lot of you don't know i do have problems with my skin you probably can't see on the camera but I do have quite problematic skin. I struggle with adult acne. Anything that will help, I'm always excited to try. Ooh, day number eight's a little, little tiny window. So I'm wondering whether this will be like a sample. Ooh, we've gone blurry. So I'm wondering whether this will be like a sample size of something. But let's find out. Can't get this one out. Okay, this one's really cute because it's so small. But it's an eye product. And this is called Eyes Cream Liquid Shadow. I've never used a liquid eyeshadow before. And it's in the shade gold outside. Um, I do actually really like Soap and Glory's makeup. Um, I have, I do use their wing, their wing dye liner. I mean, you don't have to wing it. I use that eyeliner every single day because it's the one that I found is the easiest to apply. Um, it's called like Super Cat. So I'm excited to try another makeup product by them. Um, let me swatch this for you because I've already done my makeup today so I don't want to ruin it. But I'll just give this a little swatch on. Oh, yeah, this will be perfect for Christmas. Look at this. Don't know how well you can see the like shimmer on that. But I feel like that would go really, really well if you've done like a brown or like quite a neutral shade and you just put this over the top of it just to give it like a little bit of that christmas pop but yeah i really like that one although it is only a small little size because it's christmas i feel like you wouldn't use this product all year round anyway so i'm actually happy that this one's a little little mini one day number nine this is my favorite product by soap and glory like i mentioned earlier i have hand food sitting on my drawers back there behind minnie's head um, and this is a little mini hand food. This is perfect to just pop in your handbag because obviously you can't take a friggin pump in your handbag, can you? So this is perfect to put in your handbag. This is a small size, this is 50 milliliters. This is the Sugar Crush scent. So I've got the original scent over there, but this is a Sugar Crush scent. Now this isn't my favorite scent. I do prefer the original scent, whatever it's called. But it's still quite nice in the hand cream. Yeah, it's, it's quite nice. I do really like this one. I might actually pop this one in the giveaway as well though, just because I do already have so many hand foods um, and that's a little bit greedy, I feel like. But yeah, I really like that one as well. It's day number 10 now. That is a massive, massive door. Look how big this door is. I feel like it's the biggest door. Um, so I wonder what's in this one. I, I don't actually know. I'm not very good at getting indoors, as you can see. Ooh. Ooh, look at this. Oh, I really like this one. I really like the packaging on this one as well. This is a radiance boosting mask, white flower, brightening complex with lotus flower, cherry blossom and rubos tea extract. For dull, lacklustre skin, I definitely need this. My spot cream makes my skin go so dry and dull. So I definitely need this to give myself a little, little boost. I don't know if this is a sheet mask or not. Wake up. Yes, this is a sheet mask. I actually love sheet masks. I think they look so funny when you're on your face and you look like something out of a horror film because your face is just white and you can just see like your little eyes. But uh, sheet masks always make me laugh when I've got them on. But they always, I think, make your skin feel like the most moisturized after you've used them. So I'm so excited to use this one. I love the packaging on this one as well. Oh, it's a little mini. I actually quite like these sizes as well. This is a Sugar Crush Body Butter Cream. This is 50 ml liters. And it's the same um, scent as the hand food that I just got in the day before. Yeah, I do really like this scent. But it's just not for me. It's it's kind of like I don't know what what scent it is. It's oh it's got kiwi with shea and coconut balm, lime and almond oils and kiwi water juice. I think it's the lime and kiwi. Um I just don't like these flavours flavours. I don't like these scents on myself. Um but it does still smell amazing. So I do still recommend this product. It's just I prefer the other Soap and Glory scent personally. 
So day 12 is a little mini one as well. You can see I'm opening it. So I think it's just a little, um, yeah, it's just another little bath bomb. So that's another little cute treat. Oh my God. Now this is what I've been talking about. Look at this bad boy. This is a really, really nice size. This is my favorite product ever from Soap and Glory. It's the first ever product that I got from them. And this is the Righteous Butter Original Formula. Honestly, this, oh, I feel like I could get high off of this smell. I feel like that's such a weird thing to say. Um, honestly, oh, it's just, I love this smell so, so much. It makes your skin feel so amazing. The same with the Sugar Crush ones. They make your skin feel so, so, so smooth. But I just prefer this scent. And this is my Holy Grail moisturiser. I will pick this moisturiser over anything i will go back to this one i'll try other ones and then i won't like them and i'll be like i just need my soap and glory body butter i've got one open over there it's a slightly bigger size than this one but this is really really good for the advent calendar considering i broke the price down i paid like one pound fifty for this one that is so so good i'm so excited just had to have another little sniff before I put that one away. And day 14 is a big, big, long, long box as well. This one here. I don't know what that one could be though. This is actually so much fun. I always felt naughty if I opened an advent calendar before the day. Like, you know, the little chocolate ones. It's actually so much fun opening it all in one go. Can't get into this one either. Why am I so bad at getting into them? Literally. This is the product that I've been wanting to try the most. I didn't know that this um, window was this product. I'm so excited for this and it's a full size product as well. Can't get it out as normal. Look at this. It is dry shampoo. Oh my god, I love dry shampoo. I normally use the Bastiste Bast one. I can't even pronounce that. This is called the, the Rush Hour Sweet Sensational Dry Shampoo. Soap and Glory with touch release for extra bursts of fragrance when you ruffle your hair. Yes, all hair, all hair colours can try it because you know how some of them are like specific to your hair colour because it helps with like your roots and stuff. First shake to activate and then hold 15 centimetres away. I'm so excited for the smell of this. I've already put dry shampoo in my hair though, but I just want to smell it. Oh, that smells amazing. I don't know whether it's gone on the top there or not. That is so good this is the original scent which is my favorite and i love a dry shampoo oh my god yeah featuring our original pink fruit and flory scent ah give it a little kiss oh this, i was so excited to try this so i'm gonna try and do the rest of the products in like a quick fire round because i feel like this video is so long already next one is clean on me Creamy Moisture Shower Gel, and this is just another shower gel. I think this is the original scent as well. Oh yeah, that's gorgeous. Really like that one. Same packaging as the others, but obviously it's just a different scent. So excited to use that, and it's 75 millilitres as well. This one is another body wash slash shower gel. It is the same little packaging, same size of 75 millilitres as well. Apart from this is the Sugar Crush... This is the Sugar Crush fragrance. Again, the Sweet Lime fragrant fragrance. Oh yeah, that does smell like Sugar Crush. Maybe I like the shower gel better than I like the, um, the moisturizer for the Sugar Crush scent. So I'll definitely give that one a try and let you know how I get on in um, one of my Christmas videos. Probably like my Vlogmas ones that I think I'm gonna film. Oh, this is gorgeous. I wasn't expecting this. I'm not really 100% sure what it is though. But in day number 17, there's a little um, like rose petal thing. I don't know whether you put this into the bath. Is it like a bath oil thing? This is actually a soap. So I'm guessing you can just wash with it. Yeah, and you just put it under water and lather it up and wash with like a normal soap. 18 is another full-size product. Same packaging as the other hand food, but this is the original scent flavour. My favourite one, as I said before, hydrating hand cream with shea butter, macadamia oil and marshmallow um, in the original pink. Yeah, I'll definitely be keeping this one for myself. I'm actually going to pop this in my handbag so I can use it. And same with the socks. These are really good if you want to keep the moisture in your hands. Put a little bit on and then put gloves on if it's cold outside and it really keeps the moisture in and it makes them feel amazing. 
So day number 19 is another sexy mother pucker. It's in a slightly darker shade than the other one, um, but still quite a nude shade. This one is called Plums Up. I'll just swatch this one for you as well. Obviously, I'm not going to put this one on my lips the same as the other one. So quite similar. Ignore the other one, but it's just quite a similar like clear gloss, the same as the other ones, but the glosses are really nice. They're not sticky or anything like that. And like I said before, these retail at £9, so getting them in the advent calendar for only £1.50 is so, so good. Ooh, day 20. I'm so excited for this one as well. Um, this one's limited edition as well. It's just a body butter the same. So this Butter Be Good Hydrating Body Butter. This is the limited edition Naughty But Nice Plum and Cinnamon scent. So amazing. Oh, that is gorgeous. Honestly, it just, I wish I could eat it. Love, love, love that. And I really, really like the colour of this as well. So it's slightly different to the normal, like, pink of the other ones. This is like a really, really hot pink. So love this for Christmas. I guess this is their Christmas scent. Oh, yeah, love, love, love that. 21 is some more soap. Oh, I'm excited to use this one as well. Day 22 is a puffy eye attack under eye brightening hydrogel patches with puffies technology plus cucumber fruit juice extracts refreshes and revitalized tired puffy eyes i definitely need this today my eyes are so puffy and i've got a bit of a headache and i just had an awful sleep so i definitely could have done with these this morning so i think i'm going to use this tonight 23 is another full size product this is called the scrub of your life. This is in the original scent as well. I've actually already got one of these in my shower. Um, so as you already know, I love this product. And it's just a body scrub. Um, it's got like little beads in it. I don't know whether it says on here what the beads do or no. But there's little like beads in there. And they're really good if you've got like spots on the back of your arms. Or you've got fake tan on and you're trying to scrub it off. This is the best scrub that I've ever used as well. So yeah, definitely get this one. And it's full size. So good. I love how many full size products are in this advent calendar. And the last one is the big boy window that we've all been waiting for. Day number 24, which is over here. And it's this massive one. It says, what's behind door 24? Let's have a little look and find out. So it's another face mask, it's Speed Plump. Super hydrating miracle moisture mask including hy hyaluric acid and pink flower power complex with rose rugosa, safflower and peony extracts. Make skin plump for joy, a treat for dry dehy dehydrated skin. So I definitely need this one as well. Look at the packaging on this one, it's so cute. And it's got your typical pin-up girl as well and it's got the hot pink as well. Um, so yeah, hydrogel mask is, is another sheet mask as well, but it's definitely um, like a super moisturising one like the other one. So that is all the products that you get in the Soap and Glory 24 day advent calendar for 2019. I hope you enjoyed unboxing it with me because I enjoyed that so much. It was so exciting. And I can't believe how many full size products you get. It's definitely better than the advent calendar last year, although I didn't get it last year. I did watch a lot of videos on it and I saw that there, people were quite disappointed with like the shower pods but this year I feel like every single product was so good and I wasn't disappointed with any of them and the amount of full size things you get in there is amazing so yeah I really really think it's worth it you can get it from Boots I will link it down below um and hopefully they will have some money off I did get it for £28 but the retail price is £42 which is still really good considering the overall price of everything it was 70 pounds in the advent calendar so now i've finished with the advent calendar part of this video i'm going to get on to the giveaway and how you can enter so for the giveaway um the main prize i'm going to be giving away is this soap and glory little christmas gift you've got quite a lot of products in there you've got one of the mini dry shampoos you've got the face wash you've got righteous butter um like which is the original scent you've got hand food you've got clean on me and you've also got one of the um the eye attacks the little puffy eye eye masks as well so it's actually really good you've got quite a lot of products in here i think it's worth over 20 pounds as well and um, sorry i can't give you more but i'm very poor <laughs> 
Um, so how to enter this, this is the main prize and then I'm also going to be giving away some of the single things from the advent calendar as well. For example, I'm going to be giving away things singly like the Sugar Crush moisturiser and a few other bits. So to enter, all you need to do is make sure you are subscribed and have the bell notification turned up. You need to comment down on this video and you also need to give this video a thumbs up. So just to recap, the three things that you need to do is hit the subscribe button, hit the thumbs up and give me a little comment down below to let me know that you have entered. If you do all three of these things and you get entered three times into the competition, I will be announcing the winners on the 15th of December, so you will get this in time for Christmas. I'll be contacting you via Instagram, so if you do follow me on Instagram as well, um, I'll be able to message you on there if you are one and you can let me know of the details of how I can get this delivered to you. Don't forget to share this video with everybody as well so they have a chance of entering the giveaway as well and seeing all of the products in the Soap and Glory Advent Calendar. But I hope you all had as much fun as I did in this video and thank you all so much for watching and all of your support and I will see you all in my next video. Don't forget that I do upload on Mondays and Fridays. So yeah, I will see you in the next one. Bye bye. Hi guys, thank you for watching and don't forget to hit the subscribe button if you enjoyed the video and follow me on my Instagram at underscore. They'll all be linked down below. Bye.